Texas Chainsaw Massacre and Halloween are two of the first ever horror-related video games ever released. They were distributed by Wizard Video in 1982, who was known for their VHS releases of horror movies that featured attention-grabbing artwork and images in a big box format. Due to the graphic nature of the games, some retailers refused to sell them, and if they did, they were kept behind the counter which led to poor sales. Kind of like the Mystique Atari porn games, they are some of the most sought after Atari games today. So what better way to celebrate the Halloween season than to play some good old fashioned Atari horror games? So first with this game, I was very surprised and a little bit impressed by the music. That's the Halloween theme, you know, that we all know. Oh. Okay, so we're the babysitter. We have to rescue that kid down there and escape from Michael Myers. Woo! Kind of walk through him there. Oh, shoot. Someone didn't pay the electrical bill. No, oh, I'm gonna go this way. Wait, no, I'm gonna try to pass him. Oh my god! He chopped my head right off. That is graphic. Oh, come on. No! Okay, I got him. That was close. All right, come here, you stupid kid. So I gotta drag him to the other side of the house, right? Where'd he go? I lost him. Oh my god, I can't see. All right, well, I'm just gonna go back this way. Oh, there he is. Mm, let's go this way. So I have to take him to a corner in the house. Come on, why does he keep running away from me? Come with me, Timmy. I just assume that kid's name is Timmy. I have no idea what his name is. Oh. I like how the music only goes when you see Michael Myers on screen. Ooh, weapon. Yeah. Let's use it. Yeah, I stabbed him. I think it's only good once, I don't know. <gasps> no! Okay, so I guess it is only good once, because I got my head chopped off. Alright, so I'm totally dead. I'm gonna try it one more time, because now I have a better idea of what to do. I think. Yay, dodged him. Alright, so here's the kid. Let's go take you back that way. Come with me. Alright, I think we got it. Yay! Okay. So that means saved one kid. Because apparently that room is Michael Myers safe. I do not know why, but something about that room, he will not go in there. So cool. Saved one kid. Let's go downstairs. Hey! Okay, let's save this kid. Because his parents didn't care about him and left him in this crazy killer house. Oh, he's gonna kill the kid! Nope, he just killed me. <laughs> Alright, now let's play some Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So as you can see, we are Leatherface. And that thing that looks like a faucet coming out of his stomach, that is actually a chainsaw. Ring ding 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 ding. So we're gonna go kill some people. It's a little interesting that we're the bad guy and not the good guy in this, and I kinda like that, I kinda appreciate it. Ooh, that noise is annoying. So I believe that is our victim screaming. So we just got one. Refuel, I forgot about that. So we do run out of fuel for the um, chainsaw. <laughs> I don't know, this game just makes me laugh. Cause I mean, look at it. There's like random piles of sticks or I guess that's supposed to be hay. Random fences, wheelchairs coming at you really fast. And all our victims look like weird lady polificates or whatever her name was from Mr. Rogers Neighborhood. Like, what the fuck? And we also have to be careful not to touch anything because we will be stopped. So he's really not that much of a bad guy. I mean, a badass because I mean, he's pretty easy to just throw anything in front of him and he won't be able to get you. <gasps> okay, and then I guess we lost. So we got kicked in the ass by Lady Polificate. All right, let's try it one more time. <laughs> We're just going back and forth. There we go. I like how they turn upside down and blood comes out from like their head and their feet. Like what the hell did he do to them? 
I like that house in the background. Doesn't that look like a peaceful scene? It's like, oh, just a cute little house, like a cottage perhaps, and a truck. But it's actually a house of horrors. Not horrors, horrors. It's hard to enunciate that sometimes. It's also hard to enunciate the word enunciate. Whoa. All right, so I think you get the idea. All right, so that was Halloween and Texas Chainsaw Massacre on the Atari 2600. I actually like those games a lot. Like, I can only play them for very short periods of time, but I actually think they're pretty fun. And I think it's cool that two of the first ever horror-related video games are based on two iconic franchises. Thanks for watching.